I guess in the meantime, I could also check the other settings just in case. Sound, master volume. Controls, type movement, toggle crouch. Oh, okay, I could customize my controls. That's cool. Secondary fire, quick melee, reload. Ooh, next weapon is that. <laughs> I can tell that these, like, spectate players are empty because I'm playing this on a uh, hero information is left. I'm not sure if that's very useful or not, but the square to unbind. Next weapon. So I can't go to my previous weapon, unfortunately. What the hell does the touchpad button do? It doesn't look like the touchpad button does anything. I don't know. Maybe I could, like, swipe it so that I could, like... I'm not sure if the creators have any that in mind or something. Uh, it doesn't look look like I could use the touchpad button to do anything. So I might as well just be playing a GameCube game or something. And there are no button layouts for a select button. Because the GameCube didn't have a select button, did it? Mm, gameplay. Skirmish watch search. What skirmish? Okay, so I'm guessing like it's rummaging through shit whenever I'm trying to search for things. Kill feed display. I would definitely love to do that. Always skip kill cam. Uh, network quality notification. Uh, hopefully my internet will suffice and I'll be good enough to fight some people. Luckily no one should be able to use it right now. I checked outside and no one's there. Uh, okay. I'm not sure if I uh, logged in properly. Tracer, you are really creeping me out with your staring like that. Please, can I switch characters or something? Or is like Tracer like my main character unless I edit her or something? It says 1 out of 55 unlocks Tracer. So I'm guessing... Do I have to unlock the other characters or something? And Tracer is just my default character? Hmm. Sorry for taking too long here, guys. Ooh. Music changed. Hero gallery. Let's check out the hero gallery. I got one out of 55 of everything. Except, wait, no, no, not everything. One out of 55 of Bastion. One out of 55 of Pharah, Reaper. Hold on, wait, hold on a minute. Let me see the code thing. The game shows, uh, the, oh, get out here, advertisements. Hold on. I'm not even sure if, uh... Wait, what? How to claim the Diablo 3 Mercy Wings for PS4? I get death that, or... Is that within the code, or... Or what? StarCraft 2, Hearthstone, Heroes of the Storm, Wars War... I have never played any of these games. Actually, no, I have played Diablo 3 before, and I thought that was boring. <laughs> but, uh... I don't know, does that count? Or do I have to like, play it fully or have a save file on my PS4 account? Because I played Diablo 3 on the PC, not PS4. Hmm. Hold on. Let's see here. Battle. Dot net slash code. Alright then. Your free account. I already logged in, but I guess I didn't log into this one just yet. Found that email. It's always email, not username. I noticed. Uh, one out of eleven. I'm guessing these are like all the unlocks or something. So I, I've unlocked pretty much five character skins, but not like everything else. So I got a lot of unlocking to do. It seems like. I'm guessing I do that just by playing the game. I don't know. What do I unlock exactly? Just skins, emotes, victory poses, voice lines, sprays, and highlight intros. Okay, so it's mostly cosmetic stuff. There's no gameplay differences whatsoever. Thank God. If it has something to do with like, different guns or whatever, then 
That's gonna be pretty bullshit. Uh, where's the character Mercy? Yeah, she's right here. I could apparently get her Diablo thing. Code Redemption, okay. Where's the- oh shit, where's the- there it is, there's the paper. I thought I lost it for a second. Uh, they're all numbers too, how convenient. So I don't have to worry about inputting, like, letters or anything. I doubt that there's like any single player content in this game, so I'm don't I'm not gonna like all your you're claiming Overwatch okay. Cross game promotional licenses, sure why not. Congratulations, you are now proud over of the Overwatch cross game promotional licenses. Re recently claimed a game item will be available the next time you log into the game. Please log or re log into the game to use this item. Okay. So let me how do I re-log in? You have to close the application, then <laughs> come back in, I guess? Let's try that. <laughs> Follow the directions on the screen, link to your PlayStation account to your battle. Play Diablo 3, you'll be able to- Okay, so I actually had to play Diablo 3 on the PS4. <laughs> Just to get the skin. Is that the only way I could get that skin? Or can I actually unlock it within the game? Because if this is the only exclusive way to get the skin, that's pretty stupid. Uh, I mean, I guess the Origins Edition skin thing, that's fine, I guess. I mean, that's kind of like a reward base for um, <coughs> for uh, people who, uh, I guess, pre-order or buy this game early. Hence the Origins Edition. Not only that, but it says Origin Edition, and it costs 60 bucks. So I'm guessing, like, the original vanilla version will probably cost, like, what, $40 or something? And I just happened to bought the Origins Edition by, like, mistake? I don't know. Um... I don't know, I got... I got an Overwatch cross by game promotional something. I'm not sure what that exactly is for, but, uh... Eh. <laughs> I got it, I guess. Um... Maybe you guys can tell me exactly what it does. Anyways, we'll be right back with the next episode. Sorry, not the next episode. This is a point five episode, so you guys will probably be skipping this usually. Uh, wait for the part two, and I guess, yeah.